What's up? What's up? What's up? All right, if anyone has any calculators, get the fuck out of your hands. I slapped them out of your hands. Get that shit the hell out of here. If you can't do it right, don't do it at all. We're going to finally learn how to do math once and for all with the help of our good friend Baldi. Whom, un who despite the having the name Bald, he's, he, he is also, yes, Bald, but he was named Baldi before he was Bald. Uh, okay, I can only assume. All right, Baldi. Hide and seek. Play hide and seek with Baldi. Can you beat all the levels without losing? I guess we'll do hide and seek because it's the top one. All right, man. Oh, fuck, he's actually counting. I'm gonna hide in school faculty only. You guys think Baldi's around the corner, right? I'm gonna check. Oh, fuck! Oh, wait, I think that's him knowing I'm here. Oh, fuck, he's got a fucking thing in his hand. Oh, oh, what the? Oh, 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 oh. We lost him, folks. Party at the principal's office. Come and get your present. Okay. Is that this one? Tries to impress others by blowing bubblegum and bubbles, but usually just ends up spitting them out. Get the fuck away from me, you freak! I know your lore! Oh, fuck, Baldi's right there. I'll get out of here. Go away. Get the fuck away from me! The guy said, feast your eyes, and then just spat gum right into my face. I think there's also the, like, legacy version of Baldi's Basics, which is maybe what we want to start with so I actually know what the fuck this game's about, because it's like a legacy version, which is just Baldi's basic classic... Oh, yeah, it's this one. All right, I'm installing it. It takes, like, two seconds. It's only, like, five megabytes. Let's do some math problems, chat. All right, everyone try to keep up. Now it's time for everybody's favorite subject. Math. I love Radio. math! Zero. Whoa, I think you might be smarter than me. Wow! Two. Six. Whoa, I think you might be smarter than me. <laughs> Use the item button on the object with the quarter selected. Yeah, shut the fuck up. All right, Baldy? We already confirmed I'm smarter than you. What the fuck are we even still doing here? Shut the fuck up and leave me alone. All right, how about you stay in your goddamn lane? Oh, fuck. Gotta sweep, sweep, sweep. You go ahead and you stay in there as long as you like. Get the fuck away from me. <laughs> Get the fuck away from me. Who is that? Right. No. <laughs> oh! Let's just take it easy and figure out where all these notebooks are, okay? Baldi's out there, man, but he may not know I'm in here right now. This might be the only reason we're safe. Maybe we look up the lore of these characters. Shy and tries to be avoided, doesn't like being looked at, and gets jealous of people with more notebooks than him. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. No! No! Ah! Ow! Okay, this time we do this for real. No jokes and no fun to be had anywhere. We do this for real the right way. No running in the hall. Fuck me, dude. Lock that! <laughs> Alright, we lost him! We're not going to detention today. No one's catching me that easy. Right. No fucking way. 15 seconds. No fucking way that guy just did that to me. Fuck you out of here. No! This kid needs to fuck off. He's coming. I'm unconcerned by the sweeper. I'm not concerned by the sweeper. I should have grabbed that chocolate bar though. What is with the giant cell phone? That's a cell phone. Oh no. Oh my fucking. You messed up, you! How about you go fuck yourself, alright? What the fuck is this shit? 
Let's play again yeah, sometime soon. Whatever, lady. No running in the hall. Fuck! Seconds. No fucking way he gets me. No fucking way. He can't see through this. He can't see through it. Whoa! He charged up like a laser beam. That time, that was a different sound. Oh, I'll try to figure out what the problem is. My sensitivity was a little bit too high. I lowered my DPI. This could pro this will probably change everything. He's coming. Oh no! <gasps> she has bad eyesight. I remember that from the lore. I hunt people for all I do. Who was that? Who was who was we who was that? There was some guy who just rolled into me and said I hug people and then slammed me into the wall so hard. Help! Help! How about you go? When will you learn? Fuck yourself, how about that? No escaping detention in the hall. 25 seconds. <laughs> I, I, you know, you gotta respect the hustle. No! I have the boots! Why was it there's the sound of a really sad Pokemon? <laughs> This luck is gonna save my life. <laughs> El Diablo! No entering school faculty, only rooms in the halls. Don't, don't matter, man. I'm gonna get out of here just fine. And you ain't never catching me like that again. I am get me out of here! Order, here I come. <laughs> Thanks for the help, man. You have a good day. Don't do this one. Don't. Will you marry me? No! <gasps> the child just died. Good. Oh, fuck me, man. Oh! <gasps> Oh. Don't. God? I know the chocolate bar refills my stamina. Mr. Janitor, stop! No one's killing me that easy. I'm still in the game. Wait for it. <coughs> Wait for it! Walk it! He's going around the long way. We go. There's no way that old man's good. Give me something great for the generous donation. I needed those scissors right now to dispatch jump rope girl. Oh my fucking god, dude! Twenty seconds. God. 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 Cool. No one thinks it's cool. No one. Not one guy. Oh no. We gotta move. We need to get the last piece. What's the problem? Who the <laughs> Who is that? Who? <gasps> oh. Fog machine malfunction. I have all the notebooks. Where do I leave? <laughs> no running in the hall. Fifteen seconds. Detention for you. You should know. God fucking damn it! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Hi, I'm Johnny. Welcome to my store. Hey man. Can I have the swinging door lock? You, my favorite customer. 
You're my best friend, Johnny. Scuffed Escape from Tarkov. Are you sure? You think that's what this game is? God. No running in the halls. Oh! Ball! The fuck away from me! Give me something for the great. He stole my grappling hook. Fifteen seconds. He stole it. You. Bully took it. School slotting. I gave him the apple. We've got about 15 seconds. Oh. Oh. We won. We did it, baby. It's as simple as that. At least Baldi's on the other side of like the entire goddamn planet in the grand scheme of this map's layout. He's very far away. Long hallways, brothers. Long hallways indeed. Long. Always. I don't know who that was. I'm gonna ignore him though. I don't know who this shadow guy is. I frankly don't care. Let me leave. Okay, dude. Give me some. Don't care what you take. Just take it. Oh. 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 No! Why, God? There's one more spot and it's right here. But he might be able to cut me off before I get there. Dude, no fucking way, dude. That last part's RNG and I got owned. That was devastating. It even kicked me out all the way. Didn't feel like RNG to me. And dude, that fucking game overed me. Oh, hi. I got game overed. Ain't no way, dude. Ain't no fucking way. It's time for the next game on our list. It's called Spectator. So the cool thing about this one is just that literally you are just kind of hanging out in the back rooms and that's the first level they start with in this one, in this version. So like, I really, you really are just kind of like looking around for a back rooms creature in the back rooms. And it's, Pizzeria is definitely like Freddy Fazbear. We got, we got Five Nights at, did this game rip off all horror games? That one could very well be Poppy's uh, playtime, I really don't know and I can't say, but yes, possibly. Good news is no one owns a forest. Okay, no one, that's a setting that no one has. Actually, that might be Slenderman. <laughs> it can't just be FNAF though. Uh, report all anomalies, picture anomaly, blood anomaly, opening or closing doors, line anomaly, extra optics, resize, other anomaly, camera malfunction, disappearance, movement. <laughs> he doesn't know he's in a video game, bro. Everyone shut the fuck up. I'm phone guy, except not the one that's a serial killer. Does Matt Pat know? I should call him. Dude, if a kid gives you that fucking drawing, if you're like a parent and a child draws that, you're like, look, mom, I made us. And it looks like that, you throw it, you say like, wow, good. You put it on the fucking fridge for a day and then you like get rid of it. You make sure it's gone. And the moment after, like the moment they look away, you get rid of that. That's a weird one. Dude, doesn't this fucking idiot look a little bit like Rob from uh, Smash Brothers? Yeah, but shittier? Exactly. But you know what? Of all the Smash Brothers characters that I would not want to go up against, I believe a robot with the, a level of vicious, like, desire for bloodshed that Rob has, I think I would want to fight him the least. What, and not Kirby? Kirby has a gentle heart. He is forced to battle. Rob is simply an unfeeling robot that throws things at people so hard that they explode. Kirby kills gods because the gods step up on him. Seems like we're gonna die any second now. Next one. Christmas, dude. Late one winter polar night, you find yourself unable to sleep, awoken with a strange, uneasy feeling. With your mother fast asleep, you decide to move to the living room. The Tornukto is an evil creature originating from Alaskan folklore. Its physical form is described as having both human and reindeer characteristics. It has the head of a reindeer, but with human teeth. Awful. Man, Alaskans are so fucked. What the fuck? What do you mean, human teeth? <laughs> 
However, it is also capable of galloping like a deer and can travel at high speeds in an almost floating manner. Wow, dude, that was fucking scary, dude. And now as a child, I believe that is real. All right, I'm going back to sleep. But I'm not, but chat, here's the thing. The Tornuktu has human teeth. Human teeth are not very good for eating, like meat that isn't like cooked. It, 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 that's a lot. Human teeth and jaws aren't that good. It would hurt. But like if a guy was biting me, it wouldn't be as scary as like many animals. We got canines. Yeah, but they're not as scary as like egg, like carnivore, like true carnivore canines. You sure? I don't have soft. He said what a fucking Tornuke dude looks like. That guy looks, that is the saddest motherfucking thing I've ever seen. That ain't scary. <gasps> Mom! Mom! Mama! There's some kind of creature outside! Uh, the back door's open and there's a spooky snowman outside and I threw up. Uh, all those things happen separately. The threw up, I threw up earlier though and, and uh, it's on the ground. Ah, uh, that brings me back crawling into my, like, parents' room after just, like, being, like, a fucking idiot kid and be like, Mom, I threw up. <laughs> it, it happened a little bit ago, though. I don't know what to do. Help. That ain't a reindeer. It's some kind of creature. I'm just gonna close the door. Santa Claus? <gasps> <gasps> All right, Santa. Here I come. Up the chimney. <laughs> Mom! <laughs> there's some kid That's not Santa Claus! Ma'am, there's a bear on the roof trying to crawl in through the chimney again. Get the gun. Much like happens every time around the winter season in Alaska, there's a bear on the roof. Hank's back, Ma! Mom? Mom, I do need to reiterate again. I did for- I threw up. Well, they're gone. They're dead. Do I escape now? I live, right? I guess the moral of the story is children are so dumb that even when everything is spelled out for them, they'll still allow their parents to die because they're too stupid to connect dots. They have basically constant horse blinders on at all times in their life. They are fully blinded up 24-7. <laughs> <laughs> they they don't see anything but what's directly in front of them and they have no fucking ability to look around, dude. They just can't. Maybe the book will tell me what happens to me next. It is believed the only way for the Tornuktu to die is to starve to death. So once it finds a house to attack, there's nothing that can be done to stop it. Damn, dude. Well, uh... Let's get comfy, chat. Okay, Mom, so I threw up in my room. Oh! <laughs> Oh, 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 no. By God, I can see his human teeth. Hey, guys, I broke into the uh, green wind factory. Guys, there is a horrible accident took place in this very building. Big, big, bubble. Oh, my God. They left without even taking this poor vacuum. What kind of sicko leaves vacuums like that just lying around? Oh, you can really smell it. The chemicals, the, the mold, all the mold, the asbestos, they still have power going through here, huh? And how high does this place even go? I only have another five minutes of tape. Play. Did you guys freaking hear that? I think there might be some kind of wild animal inside the building. I think there might be some kind of- I think someone might just maybe- I think it might have fallen down the elevator shaft. Might have been some kind of- there might be a rat or something. Guys, I freaking accidentally killed myself. Uh -huh. Another tragic event at the grain wind facility occurred this week when a 25-year-old woman was found at the bottom of one of the large grain silo containers. The woman broke her neck in an instant from the fall. Workers say the event occurred due to the old rusty ladders found within some of the silos. Dude, I was about to jump right in. I didn't even think there was a ladder. Seems safe to me. She's just bad at climbing fucking ladders. Dude, just fucking... Just hold on. 
explain. I think I just zoomed past a ghost because I was looking at this gr this beautiful graffiti. I think I actually just zoomed past half of the ghost spook. Hey, are you the idiot that fell into the silo so hard they died? Ah! Dude, that's going straight into the YouTube video, dude. I cannot believe I just got that on camera and lived without any repercussions. That is fucking epic, dude. I'm climbing up onto the roof. I cannot top 10 ghosts I've caught on film. There's another one, dude. Oh, hang on. That's just a dead guy. Oh, no. I have to- uh, we're gonna- don't worry guys, I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna Logan Paul this. We're gonna cut this one out. We're gonna cut this- we're gonna cut that one out. We're gonna cut this out. We'll cut that out, but I am gonna keep filming around it for ghosts. Whoa! Oh. Well, you know, sometimes I do be how the cookie crumbles. I've, I'm glad we all figured out that the grain wind incident was really just that it- No, OSHA wasn't there, dude. <laughs> Come on, chat. We got ourselves a lantern. We got ourselves this X. Just keep our wits about us. I don't really know what we're doing out here, but uh, God damn it, I'm gonna fucking do it to the best of my ability. Oh, I needed this tree. Yeah, the kids are gonna love this one, dude. One of the best trees I've gotten for a Christmas tree possibly ever, dude. All I had to do is collect it from this sacred valley. Let's get it back home. Let's get it back home before someone comes and gets me. Yep. Oh, fuck all of you. Really? Oh, was this your... You guys know... Was this like your friend? Are you all alive? Is this place... Is this place that cursed? You're gonna tell me this valley's that cursed. Hey, well, how about you get up and do something about it and you're pissed off about it? Oh, wait. You're a tree. You guys all have a good day. Is that a giant fucking fish? Do you guys even know who that is? I feel like I'm, I'm dealing with two different things. I'm just gonna glitch into this wall and hide here. Yeah, I'm stuck. I'm definitely stuck in here. But the fish, there's no way the fish can get into this crack. Let me out. I fucked up. I fucked up, dude. I fucked up. I got stuck. Let me go, man. I wanna live, man. I don't want to die out here, man. Let me live. Owned it by trees. This is all they had to do to kill me is just hold me in place. Well, that game was supposed to last longer, but I don't feel like running again all the way through it because I just, I just, I just can't. I just can't do that. So, bop. Baldy round two. No. <laughs> No, you freak! Ah! I don't know what the clock does, so I don't want it. Cause I I have no idea what that thing does. I pretend I do not see. Please. Fifteen seconds. Detention for. I just wanted to learn, don't Principal. Do this again. Principal, I just wanted to learn. That's all I wanted, Principal. I just wanted to learn. Hey! Hey, let's play! Oh, that make me dead. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. Alright? Oh! Son of a bitch. Whatever this is, I'm paying for it! Oh. 20 seconds. Detention for you. It didn't do anything. There's no way Baldy fucking gets me, guys. It's gonna be okay. So dead. Help! Guys, you guys think I might just be bad at Baldi's basics? Like, not bad at math, but just bad at Baldi's basics? You think I got- you guys think I might just be bad at Baldi's? Like, maybe I just don't work well under the pressure of a guy trying to, like, chase me down and fucking kill me. In general. I think that would- I think that would kind of strain most people. The Shadow Zone. That time we completely navigated around Baldy. Oh, no. Why don't you just kill me already, old man? Me, whenever I get caught for running in the halls. Fuck off. Fuck off.
fuck off! <laughs> Why won't everyone just give me some space already? Go away. Go away. 20 seconds. Thank God. Okay. Then I can just walk right out of here and get back on with my life in three seconds. Give me this. Give me that. No entering school faculty, only rooms in the halls. 25 seconds. It's coming back. I don't have time to wait. Looks like it's And that's how you win the fucking game. Alright, and that's how you win it. And that's how you get out of there. Give me this. God! And that's the, how you end the stream. And that's how you end the whole stream. And ladies and gentlemen, sometimes it's as simple as that. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up, man.